Here we have a Elsema single channel GigaLink receiver and a transmitter and I'm going to demonstrate single channel programming. The first step to do is to look for the CC pin on the receiver and that is these two pins here with the printed circuit board labeled CC code change. You need to generate a random code by shorting out the two pins for about one to two seconds with a metal object. The next step is to make sure that all four dip switches here are in an off position. You then remove the battery cover from the transmitter and the battery and plug in the coding cable into the transmitter socket and the other end of the coding cable into the receiver's socket. The transmitter's LED will come on and stay on. This is indicating that it is in a programming mode. You press the button on the remote for about one to two seconds and the LED will blink and then go off. This has indicated a successful program. You remove the cable. We now have a remote that is successfully programmed to the receiver. You can program an unlimited number of transmitters to the receiver, but it is important when you come along with the second remote or any other remotes, do not short out this CC pin, as this would wipe out all previously programmed transmitters.